Hey everyone, what's going on? Greg here again. So today I want to share some of the new things that I'm working on for the stadium reviews. We are on my most recent blog post that I published, uh, actually today, uh, today's the 26th. Um, what does walkover mean in tennis? So, that's, so tennis is a new area that I'm going into on my site now. A couple things that are different from the uh, advertising perspective, which I want to go over. When you come to my page, you're going to see this ribbon here at the very top. Now show. The way this works is that it takes, it's all based off um, uh, data from my website. So like the most popular pages, uh, when I have more tennis content, it's gonna show more relevant tennis stuff, but primarily my audience is, is very much baseball, so they try to show that. The other thing that I'm doing with Mediavine, that's the ad company I work with, is that we have this email box right over here, which is actually great. So the email box will highlight for a few seconds um, and it, uh, it helps me get more email addresses so that I can send over uh, monthly newsletters of like the different ballparks I go to, all that kind of stuff. One thing I'm trying to do right now is I'm trying to work with a sports uh, memorabilia shop. I want to um, offer a discount code. So nothing to share yet about that, but that's one new opportunity for me now taking advantage of the email box on my site. I want to offer some, some sort of either discount code or some sort of um, benefit of going to a specific site whether it's like a sports you know a memorabilia site or a sports ticketing site whatever that's the direction that i'm trying to go into if you google the term yankee stadium parking right over here so if you google that term and you scroll down a bit this is my site right here the one with the uh the track and yankee stadium all that stuff that is the stadium reviews if you go to the page so if you clicked on it you are going to land on this page right over here yankee stadium parking so that's my page that i wrote and then I partner up with Spot Hero. So every day this updates daily of um, what games are gonna be at Yankee Stadium. That also includes the Major League Soccer team. So NYCFC, they play some games at Yankee Stadium. So parking makes up about like 15% of my traffic and also the revenue that the site makes. It's still very important for me. So um, earlier this year, I expanded to every Major League Soccer team that I could to have uh, parking options around there. So. Uh, parking is still very important uh, and it's a nice balance between the ads that I have and also the email marketing that I'm about to start. Time for a quick story. So in April 2022, I took the train from Saratoga Springs down to New York City to catch a Yankees game that night. I was supposed to get into Manhattan at 5.45 and drop off my luggage at my friend's hotel. However, with my train being delayed two hours because a truck hit a bridge, I had no time to drop off my luggage. Therefore, when I was at Penn Station, I had to take the subway up to the Bronx to go to the Yankees game. Uh, long story short, Yankee Stadium does not allow any luggage in their venue, so I had to find a place to quickly drop off my bags. It took me a while to Google and to find one place. Um, I didn't get into the game until the bottom of the fifth, uh, and actually when I got there, the Yankees started to score, so it was great. But it made me think, though, after the game, that if I had a section on my site that talked about the luggage options around every single baseball ballpark, football stadium, hockey, basketball, whatever, that can actually be a really great answer for anyone that's in that similar situation that I was in. So. I am gonna be working on a luggage section on my site. So I wanted to kind of give you guys that sneak peek today. And there you go. So that is some of the behind the scenes. So just to kind of recap again, in 2022, I'm expanding to F1, NASCAR, and now tennis. Um, I'm working with Mediavine to have that email box onto my site. So to get a monthly newsletter out, I'm currently uh, looking for a great partner uh, right now to have a discount code or some sort of promo code for like a sports memorabilia site. I'd love to give that out to my audience. Um, it is writing about 15 blog posts per month. Uh, that also includes those new areas like NASCAR, F1, tennis. Um, and now with all that, the luggage story that I kind of mentioned too, that's a new area I'm going to expand into in 2022. Just got to figure out the priorities of how to set that uh, with everything else that I'm doing. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. This is a bit more like behind the scenes of like some of the affiliate stuff that I'm doing, some of like the optimizations that I'm doing on my site, the expansions, etc. So let me know if you have any questions and as always have a good rest of your day.